Behind me is a statue of John Smith, one of many governors, but uh, the first governor, and some people say the governor that really got the location established. But what I'm showing is behind that, there's a mock-up of what the houses used to look like. They were called stud and mud. And what they'd do is they'd frame the house out of wood and then put a strip of wood every few inches all the way around it. And then they would pack it with mud and the mud was made of a combination of uh, shells from the beach, clam shells, oyster shells, um, some mud, and funny enough, it was made also with horse poo, which I thought was real funny. And the top of it would have been a thatch roof, just like they had in England. They would take a lot of local um, grasses and straw and whatever and pack the roof with it. And these were very, very well-built homes. They would actually build fireplaces framed out of wood, which sounds crazy, but once they pack it with the, with the mud, um, it becomes very insulated and they can have very safe fires in their homes. Unfortunately, over time, these houses eroded and most likely um, fire took down a lot of them. Archaeological digs can prove that just by finding the different types of stains in the soil. And uh, let's see what else. That's pretty much it, mud and stud houses.